Now that there is immense scrutiny on the northbound transports of illegal immigrants, border and southern states show no sign they're backing down. At least one bus with 20 to 30 migrants arrived this morning in New York City. This comes after Chicago also reported migrant arrivals on Tuesday. In all of this, rumors and speculation of another DeSantis migrant flight grow, but the office of the governor is mum about it. Earlier this week, journalists, activists, and officials gathered at a Delaware airport after rumors swirled of another DeSantis migrant flight, but in the end, no such plane arrived. Meanwhile, Alianza Americas, the organization suing DeSantis for the transportation of Venezuelan migrants to Martha's Vineyard, is reportedly backed by George Soros' open society networks, and they just got a federal judge to allow them to keep the migrants that are part of the lawsuit anonymous. After the lawsuit was filed, DeSantis' communications director, Taryn Fenske, put out this statement saying, quote, the transportation of the immigrants to Martha's Vineyard was done on a voluntary basis. The immigrants were homeless, hungry, and abandoned, and these activists didn't care about them then. Democratic Florida State Senator Jason Pizzo is reportedly expected to file another lawsuit against DeSantis in hopes of stopping future flights of illegal immigrants.